Filming that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Over here, we're pulling in the low tone number 10. Repeat after me 10. 10. Okay. Now, this is a quick joke. Quick joke. You guys know who Simba is? Yeah. Who's, this, who's Simba's girlfriend? Nala. What did Nala say to Simba during the stampede? Yeah, Nala. No, but close. Move faster. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. We're here at Animal Kingdom. We just had um, the most amazing bus ride here. Uh, there was a guy, Dave, who was a bus driver who wasn't actually driving the bus, but he was just like, um, I guess, assisting the guy that was driving the bus. Um, and he was just so entertaining. We had so much fun. He was like, as we were coming <laughs> to get on the bus, he was like, how are you? And then he was like, I'm good. I've had coffee. <laughs> He was just so funny um, and then he was handing out like pictures of a bus <laughs> Yeah, he was so good. It's like little things like that just like make the day so that really started our morning off so well And we're actually just coming into Asia because we're gonna go on Everest As we've seen, we just went on Everest twice. It was so much fun. Uh, the second time we were in the front row and there was like literally nobody for like six or seven rows behind us, which was good fun. We're actually just heading around to Dino Land now. We're gonna go on Dinosaur. Our little phrase, or my little phrase of the trip so far. Um, every now and then, like when, like there's a bus come that's not our bus, I've been like, that is not our dino. So I feel like that's gonna be this year's phrase. Every trip we come, we always end up having like just random little in jokes. I feel like most people do that though, cause like when you're in, like on holiday and stuff, you end up just having like loads of little funny things that happen along the way. We have just sat down at Tusker House. We've gone up and got our first plate already. I've also got my jumbo drinks. Um, Tusker House is like a personal favorite for us. We love coming here. We've been here so many times. We are going to meet uh, Donald, Goofy, Mickey, Minnie. No, no Minnie. Mickey and Daisy. So Donald and Daisy, and then Mickey and Goofy. And uh, they all come around in their safari outfits, which is super cute. Uh, like I say, we already have our first bit of food, so I'll show you what I've got. Got tater tots, Mickey waffles, first of the trip, and some donuts. 
now Donald's actually right behind us, so we're just about to meet him. How are you? You're looking really good today. Really good. Have you been out on safari? Yeah? Do you think you could take us later? Yeah? That'll be really cool. <laughs> Hi Goofy! How are you? You good? We've been coming to see you here for so many years. So many years. We come every time. <laughs> yeah. And we always get the best photos with you too. Yeah, yeah. So the second plate is here. We have got um, banana bread pudding, another donut. This is like a cornbread and whipped butter. Then I've got um, like a blueberry bread. Um, this is the remnants of my Mickey waffle, which I'll finish now. Um, I thought I better get some grapes just to get a little bit of fruit in there. Um, these are the uh, roasted potatoes and then this is the plantain. Hi Mickey! <laughs> <laughs> Your eyelashes are amazing. They're so, so perfect. I was trying to get mine up that high this morning and I just couldn't do it. Okay, you'll have to teach me the technique, right? <laughs> we just finished up breakfast at Tusker House. It was lovely as always. The character interaction was great as well. Um, it's <laughs> my camera is starting to fog up. So we've actually had a little bit of a change of plan for today. Uh, we were planning to stay here at Animal Kingdom for uh, another few hours. But um, Rachel's not feeling great. Um, I think she's got a bit of this nasty cold that's still hanging around. Um, I'm still like feeling a bit um, iffy as well and my ears are still a bit sore from playing. So um, we decided the best thing to do would actually be have a bit of a rest. Um, so we're gonna go on Flight of Passage because we have our Fast Pass and those things are like gold dust. Um, and we haven't done Flight of Passage yet as well. So we're gonna go do that and then we're actually gonna head off to Walgreens and get some supplies. <laughs> so what we've decided to do now instead is to actually go to Epcot for lunch because we were planning on having lunch here at Satuli Canteen. Uh, we were supposed to go to Epcot the other day but we ended up having to go back to the DVC centre due to the issues that we had with our contract. So we haven't been to Epcot at all yet and we're so excited for food and wine. So what we thought we'd do is go back go to Walgreens, chill in the room for a bit, and then go to Epcot for lunch. And then we can use some of our like snack credits and quick service credits there, uh, try out some of the food and wine stuff. And then later on this evening, we actually have dinner at the Edison in Disney Springs. We've never tried it there before, it looks amazing. And we're also meeting my good friend, Jen LaForge, who you may have seen on my channel before. And yeah, we're gonna just have a fun time. <laughs> uh, Jen also has a friend with her as well. Uh, so yeah, it would be really nice for us to catch up and to try a new place as well for food. Sounds ready. We just did Flight of Passage, it was absolutely amazing as always. Uh, we're walking out towards the front of the park now. It's actually getting quite busy. It's about half 10 now, maybe like 20 to 11, and there's a lot of people coming into the park. Uh, so the park opened at seven for extra magic hours. We were here about 20 past seven, and it was relatively quiet. We got on Everest, as you'll see, like twice with no weight, got on Dinosaur with no weight, and then we went over and had our breakfast. Um, but yeah, like it's starting to get, Quite busy now, it's also getting quite hot, so as you can imagine, with um, both of us not feeling too great, it's a good time for us to head back to the room. We're actually going to stop um, at the ticket center at the front of the park and exchange our um, tickets that we got with our UK reservation, which is the 14 day ultimate ticket, I think it's called. We're going to exchange that for annual passes, and because we're DVC holders, we can now get the um, Florida resident goal pass so i think that's what we're gonna go with that is a massive massive perk for us because we were planning on upgrading our tickets to annual passes anyway and the difference between the florida resident pass and the regular pass i think is about like 600 dollars. so we saved 600 dollars each as a result of signing up for dvc just for this one year don't you just love it when there's a bus waiting right as you walk up we had a bit of a rest back at the room and we're now gonna head off to Epcot. We've got some snack and quick service credits to use around the World Showcase for food and wine. We haven't been to food and wine yet, so we've been looking forward to going. And uh, we've got a few like old favorites we wanna try again, but there's also some new stuff out this year that looks really exciting. So I'm really looking forward to getting there and to try and, and for trying some of the food. But also um, this year, the special offer is that if you go, if you're an annual pass holder, which we now are as of like 
a few hours ago. <laughs> if you're an annual pass holder and you go to Epcot four times, four times, <laughs> um, you can get a free um, mini coaster set, a wooden set, and it looks like it matches pretty well with the Mickey um, chopping board that we got last year. So we're gonna go and register for that today. So this will count as our first of those four visits. And I think we get a magnet once we do that as well. So lots of great reasons to go to Epcot right now. <laughs> So we have just gone in and registered for our, what you call them, coasters. <laughs> um, and we got given our magnets, which I'll show you in a bit. But uh, we're just going over to the, um, I think it used to be called the Culinary Corridor, but it has like Coastal Eats, it has um, Earth Eats, and there's another one. Oh, I can't remember now. Um, but it has like a lot of our favorites from last year. So we're gonna go check it out, see what they have to offer this year. And we're also gonna meet up with um, Chloe and Dan who were in our vlogs yesterday. Um, they are just here enjoying food and wine as well. So we thought we'd hang out for a little bit. It is so hot. It's not as humid as it was the last two days, but it's super hot. Like we're not normally in the parks around this time, which is like around two o'clock when it's kind of the hottest. That tends to be our rest time, but we took our rest a little bit, a little bit earlier this uh, today because, like I said earlier, Rachel wasn't feeling too good. Um, but yeah, we're just coming around to check it out now. I'm so excited. I love all the food here. So it's Active Eats that's also here. So we just got a crab cake and look, it has a Mickey on it. That's so cute. I also got two of the um, shrimp. Is it shrimp and scampi? Um, so we used a quick service credit to get all three. Disney Vacation Club this way. So we're just coming into the Imagination Pavilion because we're gonna try and go to the DVC Lounge for the very first time. Never done this before, don't know how it works. We're just gonna show up and see if they'll let us in. Here we go. Oh, how exciting. <laughs> I know, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm just happy there's air con. <laughs> so we came to Hawaii, we got the, um, what are they called? Kahlua sliders? Pork, pork sliders, I think. Pork, yeah. And we got the cheesecake. It looks delicious. So we're just leaving Epcot. Now, as you'll have you seen, we had um, quite a few little nice treats while we were here. It's quite windy, so you might not be able to hear me very well. Um, but it's been so nice actually having some wind because it is super hot, as you can probably tell by my very red face. <laughs> So we have just come to Disney Springs and we're in World of Disney. We're gonna have a bit of a look around, see if we wanna purchase something now that we have our annual pass discount. We have dinner tonight at the Edison, which is a brand new place for us, so really looking forward to that. Uh, we think we might get something cute for Buzz. We've seen like the little spirit jerseys, and I also wanna get a present for my friends that we've been with on this trip, uh, because they got married last week, so they're checking into Animal Kingdom Lodge tomorrow, and I wanna get something and have it like in the room for when they arrive. So we're gonna check out all the Mr. and Mrs. stuff and see if we can find something. I picked up some nice stuff for our friends. I got them the Mr. and Mrs. mugs and then I got them like the Mickey and Minnie getting married. So it's so cute. I also got one of these um, reusable bags. It has all the parks on it and then it has the castle on the other side. So that's cool. We are just walking now to the Edison. It's still so hot, um, but at least it's not as hot as it was earlier with the sun shining. We are meeting up with my lovely friend, Jen the Forge at the Edison. I'll leave a link to her channel down below. She is awesome. And we're actually gonna get to meet one of her friends as well that's with her today. I've been watching her like Instagram stories and it looks like they're having a great time too. Uh, so it'll be really fun to catch up because I haven't seen her since, uh, a good few months back when she was over in London. I'm also super excited to try the Edison, try the food and the cocktails. I've heard it's amazing. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you.
we have just finished up dinner at the Edison, which is very, right behind me there, very bright. And I am here with Jen. <laughs> you can go watch a clip on my channel too with this exact same interaction, but um, over there. <laughs> <laughs> so we were just talking about how crazy it is that we've met in three different countries, yep. two different Disneys. Yep. Yeah. And we we've, we've done all kinds of fun things. Together. Yeah, we have. And we met only because we have YouTube channels. So I know. Yeah. It's weird. So much fun. It's very weird. And I've made a new friend. There's Coral. Where's she? Yay! <laughs> so I knew when Jen said she was bringing a friend, I knew that we could become friends too. Yes. Yes. I, trust, yes. I trust Jen's children. Yes. Yes. That is not a good idea. <laughs> and I still have Rachel here too. Oh wow. Right my head. Whoa. There I'm, we go. I'm glad Whoa. you're keeping your sister Whoa. around. That's yeah. very good news. Your parents but, will be so happy. <laughs> but the food was so good. Oh, I just we just none of us can move. Oh god, I'm so we're all like I'm ill. I have not felt this full the entire time we've Yeah, we're saying we just need to walk around to like walk it off a little bit. Yes. I'm so full. Yes. So I'm just back at the room now. Um, Rachel's actually already gone to bed, hence why I'm talking quite quietly. Um, I had a lovely evening with um, Jen and Carl and Rachel. We went uh, to do a little bit of like walking around the shops and stuff after dinner and then came home. I've not been feeling too great today. Um, I think it's like the heat and stuff has really been getting to me and I still have a bit of a cold from when I first came over. My ears are like quite sore this evening so I'm just hoping to get really good sleep and kind of Maybe like get rid of like the lingering bit of this illness. Um, but yeah, the heat was just a bit intense today. Like so after Epcot, I was feeling pretty rough. Um, so I've been enjoying like any bits of air con that I can get. Um, but I'm hoping now like a good night's sleep tonight and I'll be feeling a good bit better tomorrow. So we're not up early tomorrow. We're actually gonna go to the um, character outlets, uh, which opens later than like all these extra magic hours that are at 7 a.m. And then we have quite a chill day in general and we've got a difference for dinner tomorrow night. So I'm looking forward to a bit of a change of pace tomorrow. I think it's needed. Um, but thank you so much for watching today and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.